high blood pressure is usually considered to be a health concern for older people. However, doctors are finding out that younger people, even teens, are dealing with the problem now. Health reporter Haley Hernandez spoke with doctors about this disturbing trend. Haley. I mean, it is surprising, right? But fast food, high sodium diets, a kid's lifestyle is just as important as their parents. And medical professionals say there's a rising trend of children and teens being diagnosed with high blood pressure. Where's the football? Aaron Farish, nephew of one of our KPRC photojournalists, is young and athletic. They want me to be active, actually. But he's battling what's typically an adult illness. Um, my blood pressure was really high, like stroke level high. Last week, Aaron was hospitalized for high blood pressure. Jessica Fallon Campbell from Texas Children's says it's a growing problem among young kids. About two to five percent of the pediatric population um, um, has hypertension. Then we know that it can cause what we call end organ damage or uh, you know negative effects on the heart and the kidneys and other things. Poor diet is to blame for one recent spike in hypertension, although that can sometimes be controlled. We can't change the genetics, um, but sometimes if people can make changes in their diet, exercise, you know, decreasing their sodium intake, a generally healthy diet, um, sometimes they can come off of the medications. A secondary cause, one pediatricians are becoming more attuned to, hypertension passed down through genetics, which they say is possibly what's causing Aaron's recent spike. Come on! He's back to normal life now with medication, but there's not enough info to know if this will be a chronic condition or if his can eventually be reversed. So Campbell says that you might not always recognize the vague signs of high blood pressure, their headache, fatigue, and it's often dismissed in pediatrician visits because kids are typically nervous there. She says it's important to make sure that a professional is checking all kids older than three with the right size cuff and if blood pressure is elevated during three different appointments, you should seek a hypertension specialist. Wow, that's fascinating. It's surprising to learn that kids so young are starting to get this, right? Yeah, yeah. you got to pay attention to it early now. Wow. Mm -hmm. And start checking for it early, too. Thank you, Haley. We appreciate it.